Now, less than a week after its launch, Boeing Starliner astronaut capsule has returned to Earth. It landed in New Mexico yesterday. This was a high-stakes test flight, as this is NASA's next vehicle for ferrying astronauts to the International Space Station. Now, the uncrewed spacecraft took roughly five hours to land. This was a second attempt by Boeing after a failed test flight in 2019. It was launched aboard a United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket at Cape Canaveral in Florida. In a video released by NASA on the 24th of May, astronauts can be seen preparing the Boeing capsule for return. Continue with slowing Starliner down. Three good main parachutes. Continuing to see views from the ground trackers on, on site uh, in New Mexico. Just seconds left. You can left. see the mountains coming into frame there. We're getting very close to the ground. It's been an absolute privilege to be the on-orbit part of the team that uh, got uh, Starliner successfully up here and uh, docked to the space station. Um, it's been an, uh, a busy couple of days uh, as we watched uh, Starliner dock and then uh, getting the hatch open and doing all of the uh, cargo transfer and then participating in some of the checkouts as Starliner's been up here. And, you know, I think that uh, we've just learned, uh, you, you know, what, is cap what we are capable of when uh, we are working together as a team. Now, the spacecraft's previous attempt to reach the space station foiled due to software glitches here. Even this time, four of its multiple onboard thrusters malfunctioned along the way. The successful test flight could pave the way for Starliner to fly its crew to the space station by next year. Though this can only happen if it redesigns its propulsion system valves and fixes the thruster issues here. The test flight also has strategic advantages. Previously, the only way to reach the orbiting laboratory was through Russia's Soyuz spacecraft. Given the war in Ukraine and heightened tensions between the United States and Russia, this option, of course, is less attractive at the moment. And touchdown, Starliner. We're touching down in the desert of New Mexico, marking the campaign. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.